welcome to the potting bench right here in South Williamsport where you can enjoy delicious ice cream and you can shop for flowers and gifts. I'm here in the kitchen with Lori Solomon, the owner of The Potting Bench, and uh, today we're going to make a very special fall item. It's the Caramel Apple Crumb Sundae. Correct. Yeah, and that sounds so good, but there's a twist to it because you make the toppings, right? Yes, we make seasonal items as the fruit and so forth comes out all summer long. So this one we're going to be making the Caramel Apple Crumb mm. for our Sunday. Great. All right, so where do we start with this, Lori? Well, we start with a pie crust because we serve in a square container. It's easier to use a pan instead of a pie. Yeah, right. So we start with that. Okay. And then we're going to be adding the apples to that. I've already seasoned them mm -hmm. so that they're ready to go. So we're going to be putting those in here. Now, the apples that you use, you, you source them locally, right? Correct. We nice. try to get the orchards from around the community. Excellent. And we even go to another one that's a little further away to get them a little bit earlier. Right, yeah, because we're like a little bit ahead, right? You want to be a little ahead to prepare for Absolutely. The, the seasons coming up. Now, it you've extends done, our season a little bit yeah. by doing that. And you've done like um, other toppings, right? You've done the blueberry over the summer, right? Blueberry, peach, we do strawberry shortcake. Nice. And I just love it because the setting that we're in is just so mm -hmm. charming. It's like such an escape, isn't it? It is. Thank you. The community loves to come and see their neighbors. And, yeah, this is nice. And stay a while. So we're just basically filling okay. this pan with these apples as best you can. Yep. Try to make it as level mm -hmm. so that it all bakes the same. Right. All right, next we're just going to drop some butter mm -hmm. on top. Okay. Just some little butter pieces. No rhyme or reason, just kind of... Right put some fresh butter on there so that it stays nice and juicy. Yeah. Don't want a dry crumb pie. Right, that's for sure. So now we're going to start with just simply some flour okay. that I've already pre-measured. Mm -hmm. We're going to add some brown sugar. Good stuff. And then the cinnamon okay. as well. We're going to just kind of mix that All right. real quickly here just the best we can. And then I kind of pre, not warmed the butter, but like room let it room temperature okay. so that, you know, it's easier to crumb in here. Yeah. Work this in. All right. So you can see the crumble starting to come together. Right, exactly. Yeah. And next, you can see we've got some crumbles yeah. formed. I usually try to grab the, the bigger crumbs and try to spread them out as much as I can, mm -hmm. just so we've got the butter again with yeah. the, the yeah. moisture and so forth. So, And then basically, once I get those big chunks of crumbs out. I'm just gonna try to cover the whole thing. There's nothing like the smell of like apples and mm -hmm. cinnamon and the, the butter when it's like baking. It's exactly. so good, isn't it? <laughs> Probably one of my favorites. Yeah, me too. All right, then we're just gonna simply pour this okay. all the way through. And again, we're gonna try to- Spread it evenly, right? Mm -hmm. Make it as easy as possible. Yeah. All right. Great. It's as simple as it is. Okay. We're gonna put it in the oven at 350 for almost an hour. Okay. Keep our eye on it from there. And, and when it's all done, we just slice it up and Ready to prep it for the ice cream. Shop. Excellent, great. Well, Lori, thank you so much for showing us how to make the apple crumble, uh, but we're not done because we're going to make the sundae, right? Correct. Now you're going to head over with Dustin and finish up the project. Great. Thanks again. Thank you. Well, this is Dustin Solomon, and Dustin, uh, we're in the ice cream part now, right? That's correct. Uh, so what do we do? All right, well, you just saw the apple crumb mm -hmm. pie being made, so we're yeah. going to go ahead and put together a caramel apple crumb pie sundae. So first, good. we have three dollops of homemade soft serve vanilla ice cream that we've already added. Okay. We're going to follow that with some whipped cream. I and like then we're going to take that uh, apple crumb pie that's fresh out of the oven. Nice. We're going to put that right on top. I like this portion size. This is pretty big. Yeah, we want to make sure you don't leave here hungry. <laughs> that's for sure. Shortly after that, we're going to add some nice, fresh, hot caramel and okay. a generous portion this looks great. And then, based upon uh, customer requests, we'll go ahead and add uh, cherry. Nice. And it on. peanuts if they would oh, like it. Oh, yes, of course. If this doesn't say fall, I don't know what does. I know, right? <laughs> Nothing like uh, apple and caramel all together, right? so it's a really good combination. Terrific. The potting bench 
just isn't about ice cream. It's so much more. I'm here with Dan Langford, and Dan, there's a lot to do here. There's always a lot to do here. Yeah, tell us about it, because you know, you have the ice cream, but that's just another part of it, right? Correct. We actually started off in 2019 as a greenhouse and a workshop. And with COVID, we had to adjust our business plan. Mm -hmm. We added ice cream last summer. Well, take us on a little tour because there's a lot to see. There's always a lot to see. That's what customers tell us every night when they come in. Yeah. Uh, right now we're transitioning to the fall season. Mm -hmm. So you can see we have a lot of pumpkins, gourds, and mums in the back and perennials. Yeah. Fall is a great time for planting perennials. Oh, it sure is. After the summer we had with all this heat, people are looking for some fresh color on their porch and this yeah. is the place to get it, so. It sure is. I love it because you can sit outside there's cute little tables outside to sit, enjoy your ice cream. There's beautiful surroundings. You could do a little shopping. Right. You have this little market area here with some vegetables. Correct. And we source some of our fruits and vegetables from a farm in Dolphin County, Strites Orchard. They're about three weeks ahead of us, so that allows us to sell the produce and also use it for ice cream sundaes. And of course, the ice cream shop, there's always something new you're adding, right? Right, and we just started up a line of gourmet popcorn and soft pretzels. You also have social media, so you keep everything updated, right? Correct. Give us your social media. Uh, so on Facebook and Instagram, that's where we do a lot of our communication and marketing. It's at Potting Bench Market. We're located at 324 Matthews Boulevard, South Williamsport. I just love it here at the Potting Bench, and I'm sure everyone else is going to love it too. Thank you so much for having us today. Well, thank you for visiting. And happy fall. Happy fall. Thanks.